Spy nail pellets are quite a common sight all over the world. However, many people do not know of their importance to wildlife biologists. But before we explain their significance, we'd like to provide some background information on Taito alba, also known as the barn owl. The barn owl is typically nocturnal, with a highly developed visual and auditory system. Their white, heart-shaped facial disc funnels sound towards their large, asymmetrical ears, allowing them to pinpoint precisely where a sound originates. Their long legs and talons allow the owl to catch prey in thick vegetation. As you can see, these adaptations and features of this owl make them a superb hunter. This carnivorous owl usually consumes rodents, shrews, moles and birds, but will also consume voles, pocket gophers, large insects, fish, reptiles, ground squirrels and bats. The barn owl flies low and silently over open country. After the prey has been located, the owl dives head first, extends the talons and snatches the prey. The barn owl's prey is swallowed whole and passed into the ventriculus, where digestive juices, sand and gravel separate usable tissue from the organism, i.e. muscle, internal organs and fats. The usable tissue is broken down into chemicals and nutrients in the ventriculus and intestines enters the cloaca and waste products are excreted through the vent. The indigestible parts of the animal, such as fur and bones, are left in the proventriculus and compressed into a pellet until ready to be disgorged. The process of pellet formation takes at least six hours. Now we are going to be dissecting an owl pellet to give you an idea of what you may find in one. It's quite a long process sorting through this pellet to unearth the bones of the owl's prey but it is definitely worth the time. The bones and skulls of their owl's prey can be identified using this bone classification chart and used to investigate what the owl has recently eaten. Wildlife biologists routinely collect and investigate owl pellets to determine the species, population, proportion and seasonal variation among the owl's prey. This information is important because it can be used to monitor owl and prey populations. This information is of the utmost importance to the conservation of barn owls around the globe. The population of small animals in the owl's diet can be calculated by how much they appear in the pellets of owls. We hope you found our presentation both entertaining and informative.